There's Molly and Max and Susie and Flash and the elegant Countess de Cone. They travel the world, but they seldom go out. Well, how can this be? You're about to find out. Stay for some tea, meet the whole family. You're certain to find them at home. Know anything in the bathroom that goes like that? I wonder what it could be. Dinosaur! There's a dinosaur in the sink. Let's make friends with it. Not on your Nelly. It's got sharp teeth and sharper claws. We'll hide in here until morning. And then what will we do? We'll stay hiding in here for the rest of the day. Why is Flash asleep in your house, Molly? He saw a dinosaur in the sink, Susie. It must have fallen out of the jungle last night during the gale. I hope it's still there. We could make friends with it and have a pet dinosaur. Quiet now. We don't want to frighten it. Oh, what a shame. It's not there. <laughs> Found the dinosaur? It was in the sink, but it escaped. <laughs> Where is it now? <gasps> it's right behind you! <laughs> a dinosaur! Somehow we've got to get the dinosaur back into the jungle. Oh, fat chance. That dinosaur weighs a ton, I bet. <laughs> Flesh, you nincompoop! I might be a nincompoop, Countess, but I believe I've just solved our problem. We can use this paddle pop stick to bounce the dinosaur back into the basket. <laughs> Are you sure this will work, Flesh? Of course it will. All we have to do is get the dinosaur onto the end of the paddle pop stick. It loves eating paper. Then we'll invite it to dinner. Oh, this is the first idea I've ever had that's going to work. That's right. And put one on the end of the paddle pop stick. OK, take cover. I'm still not sure your idea is a good one. Because the dinosaur. <laughs> Geronimo! <laughs> Flash's idea actually worked. <laughs> Correction! Almost worked! Word take over! It's raining Uh, help! Help! Oh, poor Flash! Well, at least he solved the dinosaur problem. Good work, Flash! Uh, uh, get me out of here! Here comes the dinosaur. You know what to do, Flash? Of course I do. The hair net was my idea. Uh, take me through it once again. I'd better do it. Uh, no, I'll do it. Oh, well done, Flash. You Thank did you. it. I just wish I knew what I did. You got the dinosaur safely back into the jungle. Well, what do you know about that? <laughs> There's Molly and Max and Susie and Flash and the elegant Countess de Cone. They travel the world, but they seldom go out. Well, how can this be? You're about to find out. Stay for some tea, meet the whole family. You're certain to find them at home. Come on, everybody. Don't dilly dally. You'll be leaving soon. Is this our travelling kit? 
It's brand new. Hey, real leather. What class. <laughs> Remy, too. Hey, Flesh, I don't believe it. We're finally going on a holiday. Not so fast. Have you cleaned behind your bristles? We have. All right. Into the travelling kit. I've always wanted to travel, and this travelling kit is our passport to all the bathrooms in the world. You can't put all this in the travelling kit, Susie. There's no room for us. Could I'm a sponge, Flash? I can't go on holiday without my things. It's a pity it's not a sponge-sized travelling kit. Is everybody comfy? I'm closing the bag. How can I be comfy? I'm drowning in Susie's things. Oh, Flash, stop squashing me. Have a good holiday. It's awfully quiet, Flash. Do you think we've arrived? I'll have a peek. <gasps> wow! We're in our holiday bathroom, all right? What's it like? It's different to our bathroom, that's for sure. It's so modern. So this is what a holiday bathroom looks like. I like our bathroom much better. <laughs> Max wants to go home already. It's just a super-duper modern bathroom, Max. You'll get used to it. Let's explore! Hey, lights with no switches. Well, I like that. Hey, a warm air dryer. I like that too. This sure is a fancy bathroom, Flash. I like it, but it lacks atmosphere. Where will we sleep? Well, that's what I mean. There's nowhere to sleep. What kind of a bathroom is this? We'll make ourselves comfortable by the sink. Mm, that's a good thing I brought all my things. <clears throat> is everybody comfortable? This sink's too hard. It's too quiet. I wish there was a drip or a creak or something. I wish we were back in our own bathroom, tucked up in our toothbrush house. It would be just about now. I'd be sitting down to a nice chat with the Countess. If only it wasn't so cold. The window's open. I'll see if I can close it. <coughs> Come and look at this! <gasps> Yay! Wait till you see what's outside the window! Wow! <gasps> We're in the snow fields. There's snow as far as you can see. Well, be careful, you two. Come on, Susie. We're on holiday! Everybody warm enough? Yes. Comfy enough? Mm-hmm. Yes. Tired? Oh, well, you bet. Snow is harder to walk on than I thought. Good. We should get some sleep. We've got a lot to do tomorrow. Oh, like what? Like exploring this bathroom for a start. Oh, I think I'm going to enjoy this holiday after all. This is the life. It's great to be on holiday. <laughs> <laughs> There's Molly and Max and Susie and Flash and the elegant Countess de Combe. They travel the world, but they seldom go out. Well, how can this be? You're about to find out. Stay for some tea, meet the whole family. You're certain to find them at home. A strange noise, Molly. It sounded like a splat. 
and I'm sure it came from over by the window. <gasps> it's the Tooth Fairy! I wonder what she wants. We haven't got any teeth to give her. <laughs> Quick, Ollie, get the Tooth Fairy! <laughs> oh. Hello, Tooth Fairy. Where's Flash? Help! Help! I'm stuck! <laughs> This is no time to fool around, Flash. You're all wanted urgently in Tooth Fairy Land. Us? Tooth Fairy Land is in desperate trouble. We've run out of toothpaste and toothbrushes and all the little teeth have become wild and unruly. The Chief Mola is very displeased. How will we get to Tooth Fairy Land? My blinker will take us there. There's a special yellow button just for emergencies like this. Hold on. And don't forget the dental floss. Oh, what's making that home? We're off to Tooth Fairy Land, Susie. Hold on! Wow, this is fun! Tooth Fairy Land, here we come! <laughs> Welcome to Tooth Fairy Land. Come and meet the Chief Mola. <laughs> You're certainly not short of teeth in Tooth Fairy Land, Tooth Fairy. And everyone wild and unruly. That's what happens when teeth don't get regularly brushed. Stop that. Get off. You're supposed to respect the Chief Mola, you know. I've brought the toothpaste and toothbrushes, Chief Mola. About time, too. Get off. What do you know about cleaning teeth? First, you line them up, and then you... <laughs> line them up, he says. Ah, they're too wild and unruly for that. You'll have to round them up first. Oh, there's a tooth. Come on, Flash. Let's show him. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's brush those teeth. <laughs> Got one. Gotcha! Go to it, toothbrushes! Boo! Molly and Max, do your stuff! Little teeth, attention! Left, turn, go to bed! Hmm, the tooth fairy was right. You toothpaste tubes and toothbrushes do know how to brush teeth. Well done. Oh, thank you, Chief Mola. It was some um, very exhausting work. Oh, don't forget me. I help too. Oh, what a pity. They're all asleep and we didn't even get a chance to have a chat. Better send them back, Tooth Fairy. The red button? <coughs> Oh, great goodness sakes, where have you all been? Uh, Tooth Fairyland, Countess. <gasps> What's it like? I've always wanted to visit there. I don't know. I never got much of a chance to see it. I was too busy cleaning teeth. Mm, so are we. Oh, great. 